Hi everyone, it's Senator Fred Akshar with another quick legislative update from Albany. This week, my Senate colleagues and I passed the Senate's budget proposal on our way to the final state budget deadline on April 1st. There are a lot of important components to our version of the state budget, but right now I'd like to focus on what we're doing to combat the heroin and opioid epidemic. This year, the Senate Task Force on Heroin and Opioid Addiction continued traveling the state to listen to local stakeholders involved in fighting this epidemic. From healthcare professionals to law enforcement to educators and family members, we were able to identify needs and inform our decisions on how to responsibly and effectively fight the scourge of addiction. The Senate's budget proposal reflects our bottom-up approach that incorporates prevention, education, treatment, recovery, and enforcement. This year, the Senate proposes a record $265 million in support of disorder-related services, going well beyond what the governor proposed to combat this epidemic. But that's not all. We also included measures to reduce exposure to opioids for children and adults, limit and provide alternatives to opioid use, better define controlled substances to include deadly drugs like fentanyl, screen expectant mothers to prevent and treat addiction in infants, encourage the successful recovery for those struggling with addiction, as well as provide law enforcement with new tools to help get drug dealers off the streets. You can read more about these details on the full package of the reforms included in this year's Senate budget proposal by visiting my website, akshar.nysenate.gov. If you agree with what we've proposed, please contact your assembly member and the governor and urge them to include these measures in the final budget. Thank you and God bless.